Nice going. He really showed him what the Divine Dragon can do. Now, to Solm Palace. Stay close. I hate for you to split off and get lost. Again. Thanks, Fogato. This ought to be interesting. It's been years since I visited the palace. Years? I thought Solm and Firinay had a good relationship. Our countries are allies, sure, but that doesn't mean our families are close-knit. In fact, out of Solm's whole royal family, my mother and I have only met Queen Sephoria. What? No one else? Nope. Not the royal consort, not the crown princess, and not her brother the prince. That's strange. I never met them either. Same thing happened to you, huh? I may have forgotten the way to the palace, but I remember well what happened there. It was a strange scene. The queen received us alone, with no one attending her. When we asked to meet the princess and prince, she told us they weren't there. She told us the exact same thing! I asked when they'd be back, and she said, no idea. It didn't make sense. If you're royalty, you can't leave your castle whenever you like. I got the feeling she was hiding them from us. But why? Were they sick or shy? Shy? That would surprise me. Everyone we've met here has been so friendly. The Queen is too. There are just some things about the royal family that don't add up. Let's be on guard, alright? Got it. We're here! Solm Palace. Now all that's left is asking those guards to open the gate. Thanks for leading the way, Fogato. I don't know how we'd have gotten here without you. Of course. Just another day in the life of a sentinel. I'll be sure to commend you to the Queen. Anyway, now we'd better be on our way. Huh? Uh, Fogato, what are you doing? Talking to the guards! What else? Does he have a meeting with the Queen as well? Beats me. Maybe he's here on some kind of sentinel business. Fogato, wait for us! Hey, I'm home! Home? Welcome back, Prince Fogato. I'll open the gate. Yes, let the gate be open! Prince. Did that guard say Prince? Uh, unless we misheard him. In exactly the same way. Thanks for waiting, folks. Fogato, we're a little confused. Are you... the Prince of Solm? Did I not mention that? Ah, uh, no. You didn't. Whoops! <laughs> Egg me face! Right, let me do this properly. I'm Fogato, Captain of the Sentinels, and the Prince of Solm. Welcome to my family's palace. Come on in. You wanted to meet Mom, right? Mom! Visitors! What is happening? I didn't realize he was royalty. Prince personally going on patrols. Not something you see every day. I wonder why we never met him before. He doesn't seem sick. He's certainly not shy. It's a mystery. Anyway, let's head in. Don't want to keep Prince Fogato waiting. <laughs> Stolen, miserable, torn apart from your friends. How delicious. Lady Vale. Zephia, tell me. What are the Divine Dragon's forces up to? They passed through the Shadowy Moor. It appears they've arrived in Solm. So they did not return to Brodia. They're gathering more rings. Good. Can we go after them, Lady Vale? I'm itching for a rematch. Patience, Marnie. If we wait, we can steal Solm's ring from them along with the others. Oh, smart. I'll be a good girl and wait then. You are a treasure, Marnie. Isn't she just the pride of the Four Hounds? <laughs> you two really keep on the praise. That's why I love ya. <laughs> You're such a child. Praise is for chumps. It's much more fun to be punished. Worry not, Gris. You will soon have all the agony your heart could want. That's what I like to hear. 
The perks of the gig right there. And you, Mavir? How would you like to be rewarded? Nothing for me, my lady. You won't even say my name. How cold. Uh... That's all right. For now, we wait. We watch. And then, when the time comes... <clears throat> lady Vale? I've been awake for too long. I must sleep. Here are your instructions. Zephia, take charge. As you wish. Now then. Well, hey there. Take care. Hey. Aha. Uh -huh. I'll be here. Divine One, Royals of the Three Kingdoms, welcome to Solm Palace. I'm Sephoria, the Queen of Solm. It's an honor to meet you, Queen Sephoria. And you. Really, it's a treat. And a surprise. I never expected Fogato to bring the Divine Dragon here. Out of everything he's done on his outings, this is the most impressive. I was just doing what any prince would do for his queen. That's mom to you. My son tries to act so cool, so detached. Anyway, those introductions when you arrived, there were a lot of them. First you, Divine One, and then the Fyrenees, Brodian, and Illusian royalty. Quite the guest list. I was so overwhelmed, I nearly fell off my throne. You have my apologies. We're here about a very important matter. Yes, you said. Bell Dragon Sombron's return. I had no idea all that was happening. And he created those creatures, hmm? Huh? That explains why they're so vicious. But your palace hasn't been attacked by the Corrupted? Or Illusion forces? Oh, it has. We got rid of them. I see. You got rid of them. Wait, really? All of them? You seem surprised. I'm impressed. But certainly glad no one's breached the palace. I'm sorry to hear the other countries are having a harder time of it. And Queen Lomera, I visited her in Lethos many times. She was always very gracious. 
Naturally, the Queendom of Solm stands with you in your war against the Fell Dragon. Thank you. On that note, I have a request. The Ring of the Radiant Hero, which was entrusted to Solm. May I take it? Of course. I'll get it right away. Wait. Hmm. Where was it again? <laughs> I haven't seen it for a while. Fogato, do you know where the ring might be? No clue. Maybe it's in the doodad drawer? Hmm. Please, wait here a moment. Oh! Okay. The doodad drawer. Has it been lying around in a musty cupboard this whole time? This is one of the strongest emblem rings. I... I don't know what to say. Ah, you know what? I just remembered. Tamara took it with her. Tamara? My sister. Also the crown princess. She's set to inherit my crown. And like Fogato, she's always out doing who knows what. To be fair, I acted the same when I was young. Anyway, she's been gone for days. Probably on a camping trip. Oh, that sounds great right now. So it's true. The crown princess and prince aren't around much. And she doesn't know when they'll be back. We can look for Princess Tamara. Do you have any idea where she might be? I think she was heading to the Southern Desert, in which case she'd set up camp in the Oasis. All right then, we'll head there. You know, a trip to the Oasis is just what I need. I'll pack my things. Yeah, actually, Mom, how about you stay put? Oh, all right. New kids go on without me. If you find Tamara, do summon the emblem, will you? I'd love to meet him. Be careful, it's already getting dark out. Come on, everyone, I'll lead the way. Mm. This meat is gonna hit the spot. I hope you're hungry for fun, cause that's what's on the menu first. <clears throat> And now, an exclusive performance from the one and only... Tamara! I'll be performing my favorite song with my backup singers, Marin and Panette. Ready. As am I. Hope you remember the words. And a one, and a two. Meat, meat, meaty meat, meat. What have we here? A bunch of pretty birds squawking away in the night. Ha! Cheap, cheap. Cheap, cheap is right. But there's nothing cheap about the ring that one has. Let's grab it. Meaty, meaty, ah, uh, yeah. Meaty, meaty, uh, uh. Hey, hey, quit your con. Who are you two? Come on, wake up! What do you think? We're bandits! Bandits? And what do bandits do? Take stuff, like your fancy ring there. Give it! Oh! Oh? Uh, oh? That's all? You're in trouble. Really in it, right now! In it and surrounded by it. We've got monsters, big fans of ours. These two, and way more! <gasps> so, we asked nicely, but you had to make us mad. Now, we'll do this our way. I saw a bonfire. That's gotta be her. What were those strange sounds? <laughs> Tamara and her friends singing. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Don't worry about it. People call them the racket of Solm for a reason. Weird that they stopped. An attack, you think? Let's get over there and find out. Tamara! Oh! Hey, Fagato! So you're Princess Tamara. Nice to meet you. Don't tell me. You're the Divine Dragon, right? Fogato wouldn't have come here unless he found you first. He wouldn't have... what? Uh, not important. We've got bigger stakes to roast. 
have to deal with these bandits for a start. It'd really help if you could use your summoning powers on this ring. The Ring of the Radiant Hero. I've always wanted to meet the person who lives in here. Can you make that happen? All right. Great. And a one, and a two. Fight on. Emblem of Radiance. Dang, those arms! You're ready to fight! I'm Ike. Make sure you use me wisely. Thanks for your help, Ike. You'll be fighting alongside Princess Tamara in this battle. What's that? More? Those cheap, cheap birds must have gone con for help. Phooey! That's what I say. They won't beat our monsters. That's right. Not to mention our thieves. Experts in the yard of Ransackery. <laughs> They're gonna attack the village. We have to stop them before anybody gets hurt. Marin, Penet, come on! As you command, my princess, we'll crush them with the hammer of justice. Indeed, they shall sorely regret terrorizing these poor, innocent people. I can fight. Understood. I'm ready. I'm ready. Verily. I'm honored. What's that? The way forward is blocked, but not for long. Go, Tamara. With my strength, you'll have no problem opening up a path. For 
piece. Got it. I will obey. Nothing left of you. You think the village will loot itself? Get gone! Yeah, start at that house there. Let's go! <laughs> Disappoint.
What a pain. Stay strong. I won, my princess. Serves you right. Is this... There's no future! That's how a knight does it. That's how a lady does it. I'm sorry. The fight. Remember this. I'll manage. Ooh, I just spotted a rare bug.
Okay, who's next? Please, don't worry. I'm sorry. I had no choice but to win. What you got? Retribution is due. I'll do my best. Of course. Oh no! I'll tell my Nana to hide. Use this to beat the bad guy. As you wish. Nothing left of you.
not looking good. I believe I did that. Rest now. Just a scratch. <sighs> Talk about a good time. Yes. Protect you. I hate worse than a meddler. You stuck your nose in our business, you'll pay. 
I'm sorry you had to see that. Lend me your strength. brother down again Allow me. Ow! Was it much of a big brother? Was I? That 
takes care of that. Sorry for roping you into the scuffle, Divine One. That's all right. But I haven't had a chance to say why I'm here. I already explained this to Queen Sephoria and Prince Fogato, but the Fell Dragon has been released. He's back. Hmm. It's sudden, I know. You're probably shocked. I already knew. You did? Mom and Fogato did too. We've all known for a while now. Fogato? You too? Sorry. Truth is, our chance meeting in Tula Desert wasn't totally by chance. Were you deceiving us? The opposite, actually. I had to make sure that you weren't deceiving us. When the Fell Dragon returned, we had to take steps to protect our country. I'll lay it out for you. The palace has scouts all over Elios, keeping an eye on the Three Kingdoms. When Elusia brought back the Fell Dragon, we learned about it early on. But we couldn't beat him without the Emblem Rings. And we couldn't use them without you. Our only option was to focus on defense. The Corrupted started appearing, so we had to quickly lay out a plan. And what was the plan? First off, Mom would stay in the palace. She'd work with the Royal Guard to keep out intruders. And we'd send out our militia, the Sentinels, to bolster soldiers' efforts against the Corrupted. As Captain, my job was to watch out for the Corrupted near the Illusion border. If someone claimed to be the Divine Dragon, I'd size them up and bring them to the palace. That's why you hid the fact you're a prince. I was in the Sentinels too, and I wandered the country keeping our ring safe. As part of this plan, did you ever consider asking for another country's help? No, because then we'd have to help them. We can't fight another country's battles. We're stretched thin fighting our own. That's how Solm does it. You scratch your own back, we'll scratch ours. Thank you very much. I see. I'm sorry we misled you, but we did it to protect the Queendom. I don't mean to criticize your country's way of doing things. I'm just surprised. Here's the most important part of the plan, though. If you did turn out to be the Divine Dragon, we'd give you the Ring of the Radiant Hero, and then tell you where to find our other emblem ring. Solm has a second ring? Yep, the Ring of the Crux of Fate. It's in the... Your Highness, a message from Solm Palace. Huh? What is it? Hortensia, Princess of Elugia, has breached the palace. Oh. Oh. What? How did she get in? We have to save Mom. Let's go!